but yeah in case you don't know plugins are like uh, additional software which you can download or purchase they are both free and premium editions uh to enhance change or add additional functionality to your wordpress website uh, you can buy plugins uh, for seo purposes security I and mean, there's a whole myriad of plugins i think if i'm mistaken the wordpress.org uh, repository which is like this number one uh, marketplace for free plugins i think there are if i'm mistaken 50 or 60 thousand by the way hello everyone a lot of a few people are just sending the, uh, their greetings hello thanks for joining us anyway so yeah wordpress.org is like the main uh, uh, repository for free plugins in fact when you go on your wordpress website and you click on plugins and you search there when you logged into wordpress you are actually searching on the repository uh, i think there are i'm not sure do you know Joe, like 50 or 60 i think thousands it's something like that yes i mean there are a few plugins of course which need updated but yeah the the, the bulk of the plugins are all up to date etc uh, and then of course there are uh, vendors yes, uh, sorry 59000 yeah, 59000 wow that's 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 a, that's a very big number yes so yeah there um basically you can find any type of plugin security seo performance uh, user management and anything uh, so you can imagine in fact yeah what WordPress, which started like a blogging platform nowadays, is you use here by, by enterprises and bigger businesses as well, and like even by smaller businesses to do almost everything from CRM to, to, to e-commerce and stuff like that. Anyway, so um, yeah, I think we, we, of course, develop plugins ourselves. We receive, we receive a lot of support, not just about our plugins, but we also like, especially Joel, uh, you, lo you write a lot of articles, so you, uh, you read a lot of other articles, like, and of course, yeah, people have their everyone like has questions about plugins but there are maybe i don't know like a number of questions that are typically asked maybe we can start like in your opinion joel like which is the most common question that you see asked about plugins for example yeah so uh, from what i've seen um, i think one of the biggest questions people ask is how many plugins can i install it's okay. usually a very uh, one of the one of the top questions um some people think there's a hard kind of limit how many plugins you can install uh, whereas it really depends on a number of other things that i'm sure we will be discussing yes uh, um some yeah yeah sorry go ahead no as, as such in wordpress there is no hard limit let's start from there there is exactly. definitely no hard limit i think most people have concern like of course the more plugins you have i think the biggest concerns are i would say security of course maintenance 